In 1950, the seas were abundant with fish, with 22% of the available stock being fished at a sustainable level, leaving 78% developing or underexploited. But over the years, that's changed. Shortly thereafter, parts of the ocean became overexploited, with fish being removed faster than they can be naturally replenished. In 1961, parts of the ocean started to collapse, never before seen in our history. And over the years, that trend continued. At last count, in 2014, only 17% of the world's fish stocks were considered developing. 16% of stocks were overfished, and 2% were collapsed. Overfishing leads to annual global economic losses of $83 billion. By 2030, global aquaculture will need to grow by at least 4% per year to meet projected demand. But there is hope. Marine protected areas support the recovery of fish stocks, often doubling or tripling spawning numbers with tenfold increases in egg production in just five to ten years.